it. <laughs> Why are you running like someone being chased by a ghost? No, it's after me. You want to wear? Woman, you better bring her out right now. No, I will not. She's one of my teachers, and it's my duty to protect her. What offense has she committed? Okay, if you must know what she did. My mother asked her to prepare bono soup. She went ahead and prepared the goosey soup. You can imagine. And when my mother questioned her, she challenged my mother. Her own mother-in-law, she challenged her. Rose, what happened? <laughs> but uh, my husband asked me to prepare goosey soup, which I did. My mother-in-law came to the kitchen and asked why I prepared a goosey soup instead of a bun. And then? I told her. I told her that we just finished a bottle of soup. <laughs> my mother-in-law threw away my pot of soup and started beating me up when my husband met her. Instead of him to rescue me, he took side with her and started beating me up. So I had to run to this place for rescue. Liar! <laughs> you actually live in your house with your mother-in-law, okay? All of you are living together in the same house. Nah, Biko, get out of my compound. <laughs> I said, get out of my compound. No, ma. He's, he's my, he's my husband. Oh, he's now your husband. Well, follow him now. Please follow him. <laughs> Look at you. You should be ashamed of yourself, living under the same roof with your mother and your wife. Even the Bible said. That a man would leave his family and cleave to his wife. Mananke, you carried your, your mother along as you were leaving the family. You first cleaved to your mother. Then the little fingers left is what you're using to hold on to your wife. Why am I even wasting time? That your mother is supposed to be dead. Eh? In no film. Is it my mother you are talking about? Or are you in any way referring to my mother? Your mad dog. Uncle Tagina Abona Puala Koso. My mother is a mad dog. From your mouth. You've said it. You have said it. And you? You? Your principal insulted me and my mother. Your mother-in-law. My own mother. Because of you. You come meet me in the house. Okay. It's been more I wear through a woman from your house to the another person's house. Running after her on the ma ma major road. You are not ashamed of yourself. You are a very stupid man. Please shut my gate after you. <coughs> That's the kind of husband you married. Better follow me more. Don't but please. Don't. What? what? Don't Come to you. the house. Talk to me. Ben, you better go into the house. This technical thing has been. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless. This one is enough for me. Okay. I can go and greet your mother for me. Okay, ma. Anytime you need help, just send for me. I'll come. Oh, no problem, my daughter. God bless you. Greet your mother for me, eh? Okay, ma. Okay. Yeah. Oh, my Why, Oma? I don't know. Well, Madam, so you came back from work early today. Hope I'm safe. Well, you are not safe. You are under arrest. <laughs> Put your hands down. What's wrong with you? <laughs> so what's up? Well, I'm taking you out for lunch. Sorry, I'll just wait. Okay. Change of plan. Then I'll buy you a drink. Try to see the <coughs> The door is locked. Okay. Um, did you rob a bank or were you in a jacket? Kinika, excuse me. What are you saying? 
Like I can't buy my best friend a drink, is that what you say? Come on. <coughs> okay, no problem. In that case, can I have 20 bottles? Kimika! Uh-huh. So because I'm buying you free drink, I will you want to drink 20 bottles. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll catch your back. I'll buy you a whole cream. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> we are looking for an excuse to say we're going. I'm waiting for you. Okay. Dry up while I change your tool. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> See your mouth. Both of you planned this thing all along. And you never told me, Gina, this girl, you, you, you. Well, that's why it's called a surprise. And you know I love surprises. I know you do. <laughs> yes, I know we had this planned out. But 
We didn't plan the part of the dance and the whole thing. My goodness, that was awesome. You did great. You are a good dancer, I must confess. Thank you for that. Thank you. You blushing? <laughs> <laughs> Baby, you know my leave continues for the next seven days. So, I'm all yours. Wow, that's good. And then I'll be going to see your parents. Mm. My parents? Yes, your parents. Is there anything wrong with that? No, 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 nothing. Nothing. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll be traveling tomorrow. Oh. Because I don't believe in courtship after engagement. Oh. So I want to do everything fast. Oh, okay. Yes, when I will come in. Tell mommy we are coming low. She does not go out. Okay, thank you. These are beautiful. Now, thank you so much. Oh, it's okay. I came to see you to give you this little gift. Yeah. Please so, manage it. Manage what? <laughs> this is more than managing. So, um, Onye Ebe, where are you from? Oh, I'm from Abo, in the local government, Enugu precisely. But I stay in Asaba. Where you make your money. Thank you, ma. Mama. I'll be coming back in two weeks' time with my kinsmen for proper introduction. Give me come one. Hey, I'm so happy for you. Oh no, nah, that's a good one. Thank you. Hey, very nice. Uh, give me mm -hmm. uh, Let me see you briefly. Uh, let's, uh, you know, we think uh, something for you. Oh, it's okay. Just one minute, oh no. Okay. <laughs> I 
Asa kwa mkanjuwae. Rolanda that you came with. Mkiti wa kanabo. Mama, I don't understand. What do you mean by mkiti wa kanabo? Oh, yo taro, I will explain. Is his dog still barking? Which means, is his mother still alive? Oh, yes mama. <laughs> Nami, he can't walk. He cannot walk. Oh, you thought I was not serious when I want all of you not to marry a man whose mother is still alive. Each and every can know. Nem, a man walk, oh. He got cover, go and tell him that I said he cannot marry you. Oh, you think I'm joking? You cannot tell him. I'll go and tell no, him. No, 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 no. I'm going to tell you myself. You will tell him. It's up, Akita. If it's because of the fabrics he, he, he brought to Pulupan and Abadama water, you will tell him. Go on, go on. Go on. I, I'll be listening. Abu gimi kiji me mi fa, Abu gimi kiji me wa mo bubu. Eche kwa mna obi mu na gibofu. Kia ibere mo, Akwa konanya, Pula kanata, Abu gini kange mezi yo. I can't believe that your sister brought in a man whose mother is still alive here to, to, to marry her. Mama, calm down. It's okay. Just calm down. Awesome, calm down. It is not okay. The most painful thing is that she went ahead to accept his proposal, knowing fully well that his mo mo mother is alive. Did we not all agree that nobody in this family would marry a, a, a man whose mother is still alive? Did we not agree on that? Mama. It was. So, give me a message. Well, let me tell you, girl, so, as long as I am alive, no daughter of mine will marry a young man whose mother is still alive. Because, let's go let's go in. Let's prepare the moi moi. Babes, I really don't understand you at all. I don't. I mean, you're getting me confused on this whole issue. I don't understand you. I was overwhelmed by this whole engagement thing. I wasn't thinking straight. That's why I let him see my mother. No, no. My goodness, you are unbelievable. A man proposed to you. You accept it. And two days after, you're saying you can marry him. Why? Because his mother is still alive. Oh, come on, girl. Who does that? And that's why I shouldn't have accepted in the first place. Knowing whether his mother is alive. I can't marry him. I can't. Please. 
return this ring to him. I can't continue with this relationship. After all, you were part of the engagement arrangement. Uh -uh. No, you would return the ring to him. He is your fiance. And you take the ring back to him. Ginika, what are you doing? No, you have to take this back. This is not mine. You have to give it back to me. Oh. So what is Osita going to do now? Eh? Now that she has accepted the engagement. Mom asked her to call off the engagement. Mm -hmm. Call off? Mm -hmm. You think it's that easy? You're talking about two hearts here. So what are you saying? What do you want me to say? My dear Ginika does not have a choice here. You know how our mom behaves. It's difficult though. It's not as easy as it sounds. Yeah. Please let's talk about the paper first. Stamp paper. I actually came here for you to help me out with it. Me, yeah, I'm equally confused. If I tell you I understood what that man asked us to do, I'm lying. We only have two days to submit that stamp paper. We are in trouble, and you know how that man behaves. See, when we get to school tomorrow, we know what to do. Abugini <laughs> Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. I can see you're on your way out. I'm Ginika. I've been trying to get you on the phone, but you're not picking up. That's because I want to be left alone. Ginika, I have been restless since that time. Roland, as you can see, I'm on my way out and we have nothing to talk about. Why are you doing this? You know what we've passed through? Think about the love and everything. Roland, I love you. I love you very much. And I want to spend the rest of my life with you, but I... But what, Kenika? But what? What my mother said supersedes every agreement and arrangement we had. I'm sorry, Roland. I can't marry you. Not while your mother is still alive. I can't. Um, seriously, Gina. I don't understand Genika anymore. Her character just changed. Can you imagine she told me that we can be dating while she waits for my mother to die before we get married? This whole thing is confusing. This is the same question she has refused to answer. I mean, sometimes she says it, but I didn't know she took it this seriously. What could be the drama over this madness? The same explanation she has refused to give. What will I do? I'm, I'm confused. I don't know what to do about this. Um, um, I, I think you should relax a bit. Maybe give her some little space and time. I'm very sure she will come around. You think so? I, I, I think so. It's just okay. calm down. It's okay. It's okay. It's just that the whole thing is getting me It's okay. Just confused. take it easy. I'm very certain she will come around. Okay? Well, I'll have to go back in now. I actually left something. I have 
have to go back to it. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah? It's okay. All right. Drive carefully back. Yeah, bye. Bye. Hey, let me even just you on what happened. That day I was in my house so fixing my, my water tank. Mm. The next thing, this girl ran into my compound screaming, help, help, help. Ah! I was just looking at her because she looked like someone being pursued by a ghost. Mm. And right behind her was her husband pursuing her. Hey! I'm telling you. This is serious. Yes. What did she do? What did she do indeed? Nothing. It was between her and her mother-in-law. As one is love you, see. A waste your four bono. Eh? <laughs> then the woman got angry because she didn't get the soup she wanted and started beating this girl. As she was beating her, the husband came in. Instead of him to ask what the problem was, he joined hand with his mother <laughs> and they beat the hell out of this girl. Eh? In a pudu, there was another session of beating and this time around, she lost an eye. Hi! Hi! Jesus Christ! She lost an eye. She lost her eye. Hi. It's a pity. It is. It's a pity she just lost an eye. Uh, because of her mother in law. Because of her mother in law. Oh, one car will go quite in house. Oh, will go quite in law. Hey. Ah, my phone is working. Oh, it's Gina. It's like she's back. Eh. Hey. Hey. Let me go. It's okay now. Hey. Hey. All right, bye. take care. Hey. Okay. Hey. Hey. I am sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. I will not marry you. Yeah. I am sorry. 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 I am what do you mean, all of a sudden, she started acting funny? She said over her dead body, will she marry a man that his mother is still alive? Can you imagine that? And what's wrong with that? Why are you looking at me like that? So if I didn't say anything, you go ahead and bring in a man whose mother is still alive to come and marry you. Is that what you mean? But mommy is... But what? Is that what you are going to do? See, let me tell you. If you try it, I will make sure that I kill you and nothing will happen. Just look at this girl. He's not even up to five years and you've forgotten everything that's happened. Ha! Huh. Don't get me upset here. Don't make me angry. I said don't get me angry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ah, you're welcome back. Thank you, Mama. I, I didn't know you were coming today. Oh, yes, Mama. Hey. Ah, it's good. Sorry, to see I didn't you. call you. No, you were, no. I was in a hurry. It's okay. You're, you're going home straight, right? Yes, I'm coming from um, Gina's house. Let's go. Can you leave? That one day. When I know fit to live with them all, don't ask me why. Gina, that your sister is dead today is as a result of what she suffered in the hands of her mother in law. I lost my child. Mama! Mama! Brandon, what is it? 
Rakis! 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 Mama. Hi! Mama. Mama. You are welcome. Thank you, Mama. How is the city? Mama. How is everybody? Fine. Mama. Good, my son. Good, 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 good. Mama, good afternoon. Come, let us go inside. The sun is too much. Mm. Oh, very, very okay. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, thank you. Oh. Hey. You are welcome, my son. Mama is good. Oh. Mama is fine. <laughs> Chris, my son. Ah, mama. <laughs> I hope the food is good. Mama, mama, mama. <laughs> I, I miss your food. I know you like it. I mm. I prepared it specially for you. And this is delicious. Hey. You are welcome, my son. Thank you, Mama. <clears throat> mama. Hmm? I see this beautiful lady, yeah? Her name is Ndede. She was the one I want to get married to. My, mother. my one and only mother in the whole wide world. What are you saying? I don't understand what you're talking about. What do you mean the girl you want to get married to? Please! Mama, this is the woman I have chosen to get married to. Then you lie. You cannot marry her. Mama, I... I don't understand you. How do you mean? Then you wait, I will show you why. Chisum! Chisum! No, my big girl. Oh! Don't worry, don't worry, guys. You understand me? Hey! Sawa! Sawa! Chris, this is the girl I want you to get married to. Her name is Chisum. Chisum is a well-behaved girl from a good family. Hmm? She helps me. A lot of in doing almost everything in this house. From fetching water to cooking, sweeping. Ha! In fact, she will make a good wife. Marriage is all. Mama, I don't know what you are trying to achieve by doing what you are doing. So you really expect me to get married to this girl? A girl I don't even know from Adam. From I don't even love at this time and age. Well, I'm sorry, Mama. I won't get married to her. In the year, she's the one I have chosen, and I will get married to her, and it is fine. You lie. I am your mother. You will do as I say. And as for you, young girl, you cannot marry my son. Cha 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 cha. You can never marry my son. Mama. This is my son's wife. Go and look for your own husband. Mama. Papa, Mama. this my son sucks this press. He came out from this place. I gave birth to him, so he will do exactly as I say. Mama. Papa. Mama. Papa. Mama. Papa. Mama. Chris. Chris, where are you going to? Hey. No. Just be ready to dance to my drum beat. Don't worry. Oh no, see Goku. Are you hearing me? Oh no, see Goku. There's no two ways about it. He is my son. He will marry you. Befele. Befele. Ah, what is it? Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> she wants to take my son away from me. Okay, no problem. Just go. You will hear from me. You will hear from me. Yes, you will hear from me. Hi. Mama, Chris's mother has accepted that Chisum should be settled. And we have already done that with a sum of 100,000 naira. Really? Yes, and she accepted. Um, mm. Mama, please. 
uh, kindly inform the kinsmen about our marriage because of the coming of mine to pay um, in the, the bright price. And I come. Oh, that is no problem. Oh, I will inform wow. them. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Sweetheart. Hey, sweetheart. <laughs> Thank God. But. But what? What is. You won't believe it. Ah, my company has sent me to Gambia for one month training. And I have to leave first thing tomorrow. Tomorrow? Just like that? That's a joke, my dear. Well, you have to be a fashion appointment. Okay? No, you're not okay. It's going to be fine. I'm so hungry. Okay. Oh. Baby. Hello. You say? How how bad is it? Um, um, I'm coming to the village. Yes, yes. Thank you. Honey, is everything okay? I just called to tell me that Mama is she's feeling very sick and her condition is very bad. What do I do now? Do I go straight to the village or continue with this journey? You know what, don't worry, okay? I would go to the village and pick her up and take her to the home. No, 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 I can't let you do that. All right? Right now, what you need is constant rest, given your condition. I don't want anything to happen to our baby. I'll be fine, okay? As soon as I drop you off at the airport, I will go and pick her up, okay? <sighs> Honestly, I'm not comfortable with this arrangement at all. Before you miss your Sorry, go. Yeah. See, go in the park and I'll leave you now. I'll take you to hospital now. Oh, mm. sorry. You'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know what? Mm. Mm. Sorry. Mm. Hey. Mm. Hurry up now. Mm. Mama, your food is ready. You see this one? You're going to love it. Mm? Should I bring it to you here or I leave it at the dining room? What food? Food or poison? I am asking you food or poison! Look, let me tell you. I am tired of eating that poison you call food in this house. When I am hungry, I will go and get myself something to eat. Yes. You think I don't know your plans? You want to poison me with your food, eh? I don't want to die, up. I don't want to die! I'm not killing you. I'm not poisoning you. Eh? Why are you talking like this, my mama? Ah! Pick up, pick up, pick up. Please, don't just call me and cry nonsense. Look, mind yourself for this girl. Don't call me to disturb my life. And let me tell you, you see this marriage between you and my son, it will not last. Yes, it will never last. Not why I am still alive. Yes, and you see this pregnancy, you will cry with it, you useless girl. You want to come and rip the air in the blood so. Up here, that's what you see girls do. Get out of my sight, I don't want to see you irritate me. Go, 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 go. Sit down, go. Sit down. Let's see you, go. Rubbish. It's nasty. I've not seen anything. Come and marry. 
You just run into any man's life. Not my son. Not while I'm still alive. Hey, Jesus. Ah. Mama, hey, hey, What is it? You think I don't know your plans? Plans? Mama, what plan? What are you talking about? Sorry. Oh, sorry. 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 Leave me! Leave me! It is your wickedness that made me to further from the seat. Now, what do you want? What did you want? Mama, I came to give you drugs and I saw you on the floor. And I came to help you, that's all. Da! Go with your drugs, I don't need it. I don't need your drugs, I can help myself. No, I can't do Mama, what are you doing? How are you? Mama, I am not fine. I am not fine. I am not fine. Mama, I am tired of living in the nursing house. Mama, I am tired. I am tired. There's something behind of it. Listen, I am tired. There's something behind of it. What happened this time? Mama, do you know that I walked into the house and I saw this woman smashing all the photos on the floor? Everything! Just calm down, okay? Take it easy. Just come back to the village. We know how to fix it, okay? I can't take it anymore, Mama. I can't take it anymore. This is so much for me. This is so much. I can't take it anymore, Mama. I reminded you of this incident so that you will not end up like your late sister. Hmm? Mother, those people are dogs. That woman deserves to die for all she caused my sister, all the pain she caused my sister. Well, I just reminded you so that you will be careful. Just to be careful, okay? <laughs> And I still stand that she deserves to die. Roland! 
Come on, you guys. Come. Mm, I'm fine. Come on. You're not shy. Uh, give up, You are looking good. <laughs> Where is Daddy now? He's inside. Then, then let's go. Roland, the last time we spoke, mm. you promised to come home with the girl you want to get married to. And now you're home alone. Mom, um, I, I bought this little gift for you. I don't need your gift. All I want is my grandchild. I want to carry my grandchild. I'm not getting any younger now. Eh? Mom, no problem. When next I'm coming home, I'll bring the girl I'll home. I'll stop accepting any gift from you. If I must accept anyone at all, it must come through your wife. It's okay. It's okay. Can you gift. take the gift I bought for you? Hmm? Can you go to let me go and see my making it? Go inside. I'm coming. I'm waiting, eh? Dad. Hi, my son. I have seen a girl I want to marry. Mm. But there's a little problem. Problem? What could be what could be the problem? That she says that we cannot get married because my mother is still alive. I, I don't get you. How, how do you mean? That she says that we can only be dating until my mother dies. Then we can get married. What kind of condition is this? Hey, did she give you any reason for saying that? No, Dad. Not at all. No. There must be a reason for her to say such a thing. There must be a reason. I won't add that I won't say if you leave. Find out for her. You all remember what we all went through in the hands of your grandmother. My mother-in-law. Crystal! Why are you coming? Mama. <laughs> Again. What happened? <laughs> Mama! <laughs> tell me now. What happened? Mama took home. What about him? Mama! What about you? What happened to you? Mama took home. <laughs> what about you? Tell me. Mama! Mama! <laughs> Mama! Chukwu my head, oh! What do you mean by Chukwu my head? Chukwu my head, oh! Hey, Joe! What? Hey, Joe! Had drugs <laughs> in Thailand. When I heard about it, I tried keeping it away from you, hoping that he would be released. <laughs> Only to get a call this morning. <laughs> That's. <laughs> 
that he has been he has been killed he has been killed by hanging you a bad block ever since my son got married to you it has been from one problem to another I said it I said it the very first day he brought you as a woman he wanted to marry I never liked you I never liked you and you are waiting for him to die that was why he didn't inform us when he was caught you see why I said that you're a bad luck you see it hmm? is this his first time he has been traveling without any problem Oh, you come in with your witch. Come in. Oh. Mm. Mama. Mama, I'm not the one that sent him. Oh. I'm not the one that sent him to Kakara. It's okay, my daughter. It's okay. We've heard all you have said. We've heard it. And go in. Take it easy with this woman. She just lost her husband. Eh, uh, which is also our son. Which is also our son. Because you are an evil child. That was why your mother died. Why giving birth to you? Why giving birth to you? Let me tell you. <laughs> you think we don't know. You think we don't know that you killed our brother. So that you and your useless children will inherit his properties. Well, sorry for you. Your plans have failed. We are never going to allow that to happen. Oh, it's okay. Shut up, Joffrey. Shut up, about. What do you know? Get out of this place. Leave me there. Don't shut them now. Don't shut them up. Mama, I did not kill him. I did not kill my husband. You did kill him. Okay, I'm the one that killed him. So, let me tell you, by the time I finish dealing with you in this house, just get ready to dance the musical so you can I will summon you with you! Oh yeah, it's okay. Calm mm. down. This is not time for all this talk. This is time we have to plan on how to bring our son back for burial. Which son? Which son are you talking about? Bring which son back? This son which they have they have already buried. They will not bring back his corpse and they are here telling me. Telling me! Telling me! Get up and go inside. Oh! Which you have killed him! <laughs> you have killed him! It's okay, I don't down. have any son. I see so right. No son again! My daughter, okay. I can feel what you are going through right now. Uh, just try and put yourself together. Okay, Papa. Everything will be alright. Okay, Papa. Thank you very much, Papa. Um, I've consulted my kinsmen. They are making every arrangement for the burial of my late son. That means you will no longer go back to the city as you plan until after the burial. No problem. Yeah. Madam, good morning. Good morning, Nifani. Uncle, good morning, sir. What is it? Madam, I came to tell you that I will be going back to the city today. Okay. You can leave now. But please, make sure you and Blessing take care of my house. And my kids. Because I don't know when I'll be coming back to the city. How will you do that? Alright. You can go now. Okay, let me let me pick my bag. Let's 
Hey, please, eh? Don't be offended. Have you seen my mother-in-law? <laughs> Your mother-in-law? Eh? Hey. No, I haven't seen her. Hey. Oh, Fudev. Uh -uh. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, eh? Thank you. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, my sister. Please, eh? Have you seen my mother-in-law? Your mother-in-law? Eh? I saw her. She's in her daughter's shop. Hey! Thank you. Thank you very much, eh? Thank you. God bless you, mommy. Mama, Mama, please. Mama, I've come to collect the keys. My children are hungry. Please, I need to feed them. They are hungry. Where is that, Mama? You came to collect what? Is that why you're running around like, like a mad woman? Now, let me tell you. If you know where you're coming back from, better go back there! Useless woman. <laughs> Mama, please. Please, I beg you. Ma'am, what is that? My children have not eaten since morning. Since morning, Mama, they have not eaten. Hey, just hold it. Come on, just shut up. Let me tell you. Listen, let me tell you. I am the one that locked that door. And I'll also be the one to open it. So you better go home and wait for me until I come back. Do you hear what I said? Rich, useless woman. Come on, get, 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 get up from this place. Mama, who is that? Who is that, Mama? Mama Rich, useless woman. So you came and you've been to stop my, my, my peace. Now where I'm living, taking my stuff. Are you not here? Stop! I call you, Mama. You want to come and disturb my peace? Rich like you. I'll start to name my son. Baba, Baba, I don't know what I've done to Mama. Baba, do you know? 
Do you know that? My children have not eaten anything since morning, Papa. Why? I don't know. Mama locked the inside and went out with the kids. Suma. Okay, don't worry, I know what to do. Stop crying. I'm going to break that door right now. Which door? Which break with the which door? Eh? Don't ever try it. Why will you lock the children inside? Come on, go open the door for me. Which which of a woman? So you're reporting me to him. Go on, open the door. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay, stop crying, it's okay. Where are you going with your bag and ticket? Hmm? Papa, please, I have to go. I have to go. I can't stay here anymore. I don't want to die before my time, Papa. My daughter, I understand. But please, stay a little while now, please. No, Papa. Hey. I have to go back to the city. Please. Hmm. <laughs> Ginika, where's my car keys? You're looking for something, right? <laughs> You're looking for the car keys. Come on, give, 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 give it to me. Give, give it to me. <laughs> Why are you with the car keys? Can you do drive a car? Please, please. please. <laughs> I never wanted my son to marry this stupid girl. A girl who has a child in her father's house. Who knows whether these children are my son's children? Eh? Ah. Who knows if it's the same man that got her pregnant? Why she was in her father's house that is responsible for these children? Ah, go you shut up your mouth. Ah, do you understand the meaning of what you're saying? That our son is impotent. That he cannot implement the woman. Is that what you're saying? Ah, please, don't, don't let people hear you. Otherwise, they will laugh at you. My, my mm. daughter, please, take my grandchildren to the city. Whenever I need to see them, I will come to the city. You better go. I don't want to see you. I'm not going to go inside. Is that what you're saying? Yes. Let's okay. Go do and come. Inside. Do and come in. Hey. Useless you woman. That came my, my son and you. Now, Let please. me see you. Which of a woman? I'm not this girl to rest. Please. Go. You. Get out of here. Get out of here. The child has affected me also. Go, go and come back. Useless oh. woman. Which of a woman? Who? We all returned to this house because Grandpa made it possible. He outlived his wife. That was why he was able to do that. Grandmother wanted to take everything away from her son. And that is why only man qualified to marry any of you must be a man whose mother is dead. When I say dead, I mean dead and buried. Do we all agree to that? Yes, Mama. Yes, Mommy. Roland, this will be the last time I will serve you food in this house. Go and marry a wife that will always serve you food each time you visit home. Okay, Lano? Mom, are we still on this? I thought I told you I've heard. You told me you've heard. The same thing you told me last time you visited. 
<clears throat> Why are you keeping me in suspense? You told me you come home with a girl. Meanwhile, you don't have a girl. Eh? And you know you don't have to lie. He did not lie. How do you mean? The girl is not good for him. Ah ah. OBDK. Do you know her? Have you seen her before? How can you just condemn someone else's child? Eh? It's not fair. The most important thing here is if they both love each other. Any third party's opinion does not count. Roland, do you love her? Mom, I love her. Okwagu. Okwagu. Molly. You know why? Because the girl in question said she would never marry your son while you are alive. Eh? Uh -huh. So show me where love is. So when are you coming to see us again? Oh, you're missing us already. Well, don't worry. We will come back very soon. <laughs> okay. Hello? Okay, I'll be there soon. Okay. What's the matter? It's Felix. He said his mother is very sick and she's at the hospital now. Well, um, I think the condition must be very critical. For her to be in the hospital, then it's something serious. Yes, from the way he sounded. <coughs> you know what? That would be very, very nice because his dream come true. Yes! I can't wait! Come, I can't wait to hear the good news! Okay, 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 guess. Yes, I know this is good news. But remember, this is somebody's mother we are talking about. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know every woman being is selfish. I'm not saying anything much, you know? Yes, I understand. But then you have to pray to God. Because the Bible says, Ask and you will receive <laughs> that's it that's why i need you to, to join me in this prayer not only prayer with fasting six to six so <laughs> oh God, i can't wait, I can't wait. Okay. <laughs> okay not just prayer okay. <laughs> <laughs> don't ask me why do do i love a more that one day inside my heart are the fever a more that one day Better so doctor what exactly is wrong with your mother um it's nothing serious, just accumulated um, malaria and typhoid. Mm. There's nothing to worry about. You should just have her, med uh, her medications and rest. She'll be fine. She'll be fine. I am sorry, I am sorry. Why are you not happy saying it? I'm happy. So why are you not saying it? I'm fine. I'm okay. You were okay when we were at the hospital together. But what I don't understand is your sudden change of mood. Felix, it can be mood swing. Oh, come on. You're better than this. You and I know that you're not good at mood swing. Okay, you know what? Let's go down there and help. No, I want to go home. My mother is waiting for me. Okay, fine. I'll drop that. I am sorry, I am sorry. Oh, one kid, I can't have one, I will not marry you. I am sorry, I am sorry. Oh, one kid, I can't have one, I will not marry you. True, true, I love her more than one day. Inside my heart, I live for her more than one day. When I know fit to live with her more, don't ask me why. Even kitty a canabo, don't ask me why. True, true, I love her more than one day. Inside my heart, I live for her more than one day. 
When I know fit to live with them. Just somebody that gave me a lift. Is it Felix? No, mommy. Are you sure? <laughs> you people think that I don't know, but I hear you when you're on the phone talking with you, discussing. You guys think that I'm not aware of what's going on in this house. I am aware. Very aware. So this one that dropped you, this is dog still back in. Mommy, I don't know anything about the guy. He's just someone that gave me a lift. Okay, mama. It's better that the dog doesn't die. That one day, inside my heart, I don't feel for That one day, when I know fit to live with them all. Don't ask me why. Even kitty a canabo. Don't ask me why. Um, but, Homo, why did you have to lie to Mama? After all, you've known Felix for more than two years now. You didn't just meet him. Ella, what do you expect me to say? I couldn't have defended myself. You know the next question would be, is this dog still barking? Because he came Mama Jerome. Anyway, actually, it's the same thing. She said his um, mother is recovering from her sickness. Mm, so there was no point, actually. I get your point. But seriously, you and Sister Ginika are trying. You know? Honestly, when a guy asks me out for dates, I will just go straight to the point and ask him, Is your mother still alive? Eh? Ella! Kikos is digging on corner. Why are kids calling you like mother like daughter? I don't understand you. It's just an ordinary date. See, date is different from serious relationship. I'm eh, coming in a eh. See, is it not from club that they enter dance? How does serious relationship start? Is it not from dates? Please, please, please. I don't have that power. As soon as the guy comes, I will just ask. Because I will not wait for it to arise first. This is your situation. Mbano. I am sorry, I am sorry. Let's win this thing. Oh, I'm, I'm not even surprised. I'm, sorry. I'm not surprised. I am sorry, I am sorry. Oh, one kid, I will not marry you. True, true, I love her more. That one day. Inside my heart, I don't feel for her more. That one day. But I know fit to live with her more. Don't ask me why. Don't ask me why. You're still sleeping at this time. Are you not going to work? I'm not feeling too well. I woke up with a headache. Oh, no, sorry, darling. Well, I really need to run. But just call me in case you need anything, okay? Okay, I will. And please remember to take some pills, okay? Alright, have Bye. a good day. Young man, who are you looking for? I'm Ugoma's friend. Ugoma's friend? Yes. What kind of friend? Um, 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 um a kind of friend. <laughs> I see. So, for how long have you people known each other? Two years now, ma. Two years? Exactly. Hey, interesting. 
Me all take go now outside no time. I see. So now, uh, um, what is your name? My name is Felix, ma. Felix. Yes, ma. I see. And where are you from? I'm from the neighboring village here, Amatala. I actually came from Abuja because of my sick mother. Your mother is sick. Yes, ma. But um, it's just uh, typhoid fever and malaria. She's fine. She'll be discharged soon. Do you know that some people actually die from typhoid? Um, but in this case, she's fine. The doctor says she will be discharged tomorrow, maybe. Okay, thank God for you. Anyway, so what do you want with my daughter? <laughs> um, your daughter is a very nice girl, and um, we're just talking and hoping to take this relationship to the next level. My daughter is a nice girl, I know. She's, she's nice. my daughter. And when you're talking of next level, what do you mean by next level? Uh, marriage. <laughs> <laughs> marriage. <laughs> now, let me tell you something. You cannot marry my daughter. Ewo. You see, Ewo, you're not qualified to marry my daughter. So stop wasting your time with her. And please, stop seeing her. I wouldn't want you to jeopardize her chances of meeting someone more qualified than you are. But, madam, how do you mean more qualified? I, I'm a businessman and I'm doing very well for myself. I can take care of your daughter. But your dog is back. You mean my dog in Abuja? Or... Get out of my compound. Please! Say no, but Muki ne Malaka Kuga Mosquitia Mili Zobe Zobe Amu Chapa Chapa Agaima Bamu Monia Malonketa Agaima Bamu Monia Palomas Kinika, my goodness, Kinika, you are burning. Stand up, stand up. We have to go to the hospital. Mm -hmm. Stand up, stand up. We have to go to the hospital. Are you okay? Kinika, we have to go to the hospital. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Ginika, we really have to go to the hospital. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. my house. Would you by any chance meet my mom? Yes, I did. Oh! Felix, you have, you have finished me. me. Why now? Why? God, hey God, why now? Why? I went to school. You should have come to my school. How am I supposed to know you're not around? Moreover, I was trying your number and your number was not going through. Well, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to put you into any form of trouble. That's why I still stayed out here waiting for you. I've heard you. But what does your mom mean by she, she won't have me as an obstacle to more qualified men? What does she mean by that? Why, why would she say that? Qualified to do what? To marry you, of course. Felix, are we talking about marriage here or are you directly proposing to me? Wait, how can we be talking about marriage when your mom has already rejected me? Felix, until we start talking about marriage, for now, I don't have an answer to this question. So, how is your mother? Is she getting better? Well, she's fine. I came here so that you will accompany me to the hospital to go and see her. 
Please, I'm not going. I'm going home. See you later. Bye. Ugo. Ugo. Good afternoon. Mommy, I'm so sorry. I never meant to lie to you. But because... Come on, can I kiss you? I can I but, And I didn't know how to tell you he was Felix. Please. End that relationship. You can tell me that way. I am sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. Well, babe, I have to go. I don't, I don't get you. What do you mean you have to go? You mean you're not spending the night here? <laughs> Sorry for you. You have to sleep in this whole house alone. I have to go take care of my man. Give it to him the way he wants it. Jenica, don't be a waste. Don't waste your eye. Oh. <laughs> Can we go? <laughs> don't waste your life, oh. Don't waste your... Good night. Let's <laughs> go. Ginika, staring at this love resort would not change the fact that you are pregnant for the wrong man. The question is, would you keep the baby or would you abort it? Yenika! Thank you. Um, where is Yenika, your friend? Um, actually, she's not back from work. She's not back? By this time of the night? She closes by 5 p.m. What's, what's wrong? Yes, 5 p.m. She closes at 5. I got back to the house and didn't meet her at home. I I've been all by myself. Oh, okay, okay. Let me try her number. <laughs> yeah. um, it's, it's not connecting. Uh, um, let, let, me try, let me try again. Yeah. Do you really have to try? Um, it's not connecting. I should be leaving. Maybe I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right. Okay. I'll tell her you dropped by. Thanks for coming. Oh. 
Okay, Ginika. That was close. Really close. How would he come to your house without informing me? Exactly what I asked him. In fact, I was mad at him. Hey, I am not dying at exact words. Call of relationship. Oh, yes. Get that about a family. What does that mean? After everything that happened between my mom and her mother in law, that's my grandmother. Right. She refers to. Oh, mother in laws as Nikitana Aboja. That's why she will always ask Nikitia Kanabo. Oh, God. So, what are you going to do now? Eh? You end relationship. Because Nikita Phoenix Kanabo, no? Eh? Okay, well. <laughs> you don't say anything. Better talk now. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let me go in now. Two weeks time. Hey! Gazi Eh? Impromptu. Gini. You have a surprise for me. What is the surprise? Gossi, I don't like the sound, you know that. Okay, hint me. Until you come back. Gossi, two weeks can I hear, Chacha? Okay. Alright, I will wait for you. And I'm happy, I'll keep it for you too. Eh, I'm glad now. Okay, bye. Hey, your brother has a surprise for me. I wonder. Anyway, surprise is a surprise now, mommy. When he comes, we will know. Give me my phone first. Take your phone. <laughs> He's coming in two weeks. <laughs> hey, I got the salsa. Hey, I can't wait. Oh, yeah, you chaff up one. I can't papa. Oh, hey, God. Mm -hmm. Good afternoon, sir. Hey, no. How are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm all right. I'm all right. Are you? Hi, sir. Mm. Dad, the tone of your voice makes me restless. What is the problem? Ah, ah, no, 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 Papa. Nothing is the problem. There's no problem. Everything is all right. I only really wanted you to rush because. Who could that be? Okay. Who was that? That was the Makana Rambo. Eh? We are going to open the parcel. Don't pinch it. Come, 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 come. Dad, I thought, I thought this is something so serious. Eh? You think you called me on the phone? Eh? 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 Um, okay. <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm fine. Hi, good afternoon. Hello, how are you? Good. This is Messi, mm, the professional nurse in Enugu. And uh, she happens to be the daughter of one of my best friends, oh. Engineer Igwe. 
Okay. <laughs> Mercy, how are you? I'm good. Okay. <laughs> nice to meet you. My son. <laughs> Rola, uh, so, Mercy, do you work with a private hospital or federal government hospital? No, I work with private clinic, but I'm hoping to work with Federal, uh, federal Medical Center because I have submitted my application and I happen to have an interview there, though I have gone for their interview and I'm sure that I'll pass. And very soon I'll travel to UK because my dad is planning to send me there for my masters and when I come back I can work with any hospital of my choice. And you know my dad is an engineer and he doesn't want me, he doesn't like me stressing myself. As you can see, I'm stressed already. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> and very soon I'll also go back to US for my doctorate degree. So I can study and study because that's what my daddy wants for me. All I need to do is just read, read and read. <laughs> I hope it's not bad. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> 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 what, what, what kind of arrangement is this? What, what, what is it? Yeah? What, what, how, why do you want me to see her? Yeah? How can you invite me all the way from Asaba to this place to come and see her? What am I seeing her for? No, mom, tell me for what? Roland, it's your father. Eh? He thinks you like her and marry her. Mom, I'm disappointed. I am very disappointed. Bah, bah, don't be disappointed. See, she is the type of woman every man would wish to have as a wife. She's from a good family. And she's a qualified nurse. Dad, I'm more disappointed. I am more disappointed. Dad, I don't know why a nurse should subscribe for this kind of arrangement. This is height of desperation. Mom, Dad. Please listen, I beg you in the name of God, please, nobody should try this again. Biko, don't try it again, please. Uh, Roland! Hey, you see what I told you? I told you. I told you I don't like this kind of arrangement. See, go and know what to tell her. My hands are off. Go and know what to tell her. He make it go. Roland, the chili went Uh, do you think he likes me? Of course. See, you're a pretty lady. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you see, he, 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 he received an urgent call from his office. And that was why he had to rush back, okay? And I will talk to your father. So that we'll pick everything up from there. <laughs> nice one, sir. <laughs> I really appreciate it. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. Miss <laughs> Felix, please take the call. <laughs> Hello, good evening. Yeah, good evening, Ugoma. No, it's not Ugoma. It's her younger sister. My name is Ella. Oh, okay. So where is Goma? Can I speak with her? No. Why, if I may ask? Why? Ha! She does not want to have anything to do with you again. Don't you understand? Please, stop disturbing her. In fact, if you want to marry my sister, kill your mother. Jesus, what? Did I call the wrong number? This is Goma's number now. Yeah. What, what's going on here? I was hearing voices. Mama, it's Felix, Ugoma's boyfriend. Felix, what about him? Mama, get your camera ball. Ah, whoa, whoa, wow, wow. <laughs> hey, I know, ma, no one If it's him, pick the call. Go okay, now. Hello, Felix. Sorry, I can't continue with this relationship. It's over between us. Please. Ugoma. But why? What is happening? What's really happening? 
Hello, Felix. This is Ugo Mas Manga. How many times have I told you that you're not qualified to have anything to do with my daughter? No, 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 no. If you think that you love her so much that you would really want to settle down with her, you know what? After this telephone conversation, kill your mother. But I know you can't do it because you don't have the liver. So, stay away from my daughter. Out calling her. And you know what else? After this conversation, delete her number from your phone. Goodbye and have a good day. What? That woman's mad. She's crazy. What does she mean, kill your mother? Can you imagine? Stupid old witch. Eh? She doesn't know I have a serious relationship with my girlfriend. I'm only whiling away with her daughter and wasting her. You will be the first to die, you stupid old winch. Delete his number from the phone. I mean like now. Okay. I am sorry, I am sorry. I will not marry you. I am sorry, I am sorry. I will not marry you. But I know fit to live with them all. Don't ask me why. I'm still waiting for you to tell me your decision as regards your pregnancy. Or have you aborted a child without telling me? God forbid. I'll never do that. So what you're saying in essence is that you're keeping the child? Yes, I am. You know I don't support abortion. And it won't start today. Girika, let me ask you. On what condition are you keeping this child? I don't care. I'm not having an abortion. And I'm keeping my child. But you know your mother will not be happy with this. And she won't support abortion either. So what you're saying is that you're going to keep the child and wait until Roland's mother dies, even if it takes 20 years? Gina, I've made up my mind. No abortion and I'm keeping my baby. Okay, fine. Do whatever you want. I'll have to... Go back to my room now. Good night. Good night.
Come on, come on, come on. Hey! <laughs> good to see you, my dear. How are you? I'm fine. You're looking so good. I hope some people will not forget me because Mona is back now. You <laughs> I didn't know you meant it when you said you were Nigerian. Oh, I meant it. Hey! 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 Hey, Roland! So, Mom, there's this very good friend of mine. He has been a great help to me. He helped me out in school, financially during my graduation. He's a staff in my school. Okay. So, um... Only God knows what you guys are discussing. <laughs> I don't remember how to quit courts. I'm only discussing about my sweetheart. Mm hmm. That's interesting. So, Mom, what's this hulabu about the lady he engaged? I don't understand what you mean by hulabu. Or did you see me in your class in London? <laughs> <laughs> The issue is that she said, I, your mother, has to die before she marry your brother. What the heck? Mona, that is what happened. Mom, do you have any issue with her? Me? Issue? No, I have not even set my eyes on her. Not to talk of having issues with her. Why does she want you dead? Not only how, even her mother said none of her children will marry any man whose mother is still alive. Honestly, mom, I've heard this from our Nigerian girls in school. I never knew is this serious. Ah, it is so. Ha. It is so. Yes. So, bro, what are you going to do? What do you want me to do? She says she can't marry me. So, are you going to kill mom? <laughs> Where's Mama? You don't look too well. What's the problem? Where's Mama? I am here. Kineka, I'm walking out so I am solidly behind you. It's not a big deal having a child out of wedlock. It is better than entering hell all in the name of marriage. I am not ashamed of you, nor my forthcoming grandchild. The mistake has already been done. Mama, but should I tell him? Tell him what? Mama, don't tell him anything. Oh. Except you're ready to marry him tomorrow. That is, if his mother is dying tomorrow. But for now, eh? you need to keep it a secret between us. But Mama, what if he marries another girl before his mother dies? Eh? Okwadipanya? Then the secret remains with us forever. Kineka, I will take care of you now. Is it not better that I take care of you than some mad dog backs down your head all the time? Nketala. All in the name of a uh, mother in law. Hey, this is a uh, Sonia. 
my friend, the girl I told you I've been inviting from Abuja to come and stay with you while you get better. Mama, good afternoon. You're welcome. Uh, come, come, let's go inside. What do you think you are doing? Are you sweeping or you are playing? Huh? Hey! You don't know how to do anything. Huh? What type of woman do you Mama. What is it? Stop, Mama. Look at the girl you brought to help me. She doesn't know how to cook. She doesn't know how to, to, to sweep. She doesn't know how to do anything in the house. What type of woman do you exist? Why now? Why are you doing this to Sonia? I don't want to talk too much. If you know where you brought this girl, you better send her back. I don't want to talk. Yes! Just allow her to be now. What kind of trouble is this? Just sleep again, eh? Somebody will not hear what. Mama, I'm so good, Mama. Yeah, we can go bring this back. Yes, we know. Hi, Gina. Hi, Stanley. How have you been? I've been around. You know, Gina, you know I've made much effort to make you look my direction. But the harder I tried, the more drawn away you were. So I decided to take a chill pill. Like the saying goes, if you love a thing so much, set it free. And if it comes back to you, then it's meant to be. So how is your boyfriend, the one whom you've rejected me for? He's fine. He's good, actually. He's been out of the country for four months on an academic program. I hope his absence will give me the much desired opportunity. <laughs> oh, come on, Stanley. You, you never quit. Never. Quitters are losers. Yeah, my mom, she's late. The bearer is on the 17th of this month. I, I want you to be there. I, I, I didn't know you lost your mother. I'm so sorry. Accept my condolence. 
I know it's a short notice. Let me get the card. Here it is. I know it's just two days from now. I'll take off your transport and every other thing you need. Well, it's okay. I'm, I'll be there. I'll try. I'll try my best. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. So, I'll be expecting you. That's all right. Don't tell me you attended that bear. Well, of course I am. I mean, I need to give him a chance. What? A chance? What about Val? Val, Val. Well, we all know his dog still barks. I mean, his mother is still alive. And readjusting myself at this point in time is the best thing for me to do. Otherwise, I'll keep hurting myself. You're correct. Self first. Uh -huh. Meanwhile, I'm leaving first thing tomorrow morning to the village. My half brother just came back. Oh, Gossier. After 11 years, right? Yeah, correct. Oh, <laughs> good news. Well, I wish I was going with you. Seriously. Sorry, you'll see him soon. Yes, I know I will see him very soon. But first things first, mm -hmm. Madame, if you go to that village mm -hmm. and come back without my own goodies, this house will not contain me and you. <laughs> Make sure you don't finish the goodies alone. See, I know you. See, see her mouth. So that's where your mind is, Abby. Uh-uh. Bring my mind, Godet. My dear, make sure you don't finish those goodies. Bring my own. I have said my own. Yes, ma, I don't hear you. <laughs> If you ask me, I think you're getting yourself worked up over nothing. Please, I just need you to trust me on this one. I need patience and time. I'm going to talk to Mama over this. Please. I'm sorry, but I can't do this anymore. My stay here is only worsening your other situation. How? I know you asked me to come and take care of your sick mom. But I don't think my stay here is helping her. She doesn't appreciate anything I do. If I cook, she complains. If I sweep, she complains. My stay here, I'm sorry, but I think my stay here is only worsening her situation. I need to go back to Abuja. Babies, going back to Abuja does not solve this issue. It does not. I just need you to trust me. Give me time, okay? I'm going to talk to her. Relax. Oh, my seat. Wow. Show me. Jesus. Come oh, it's really oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, you too. You actually came to this village. I didn't even bother to tell me. Uh, no, it's not like that. I just came back two days ago. Yeah. So, where are you going to? <laughs> Nowhere, actually. I'm just taking a walk around the village. Okay, so are you done? Like, programs, masters, everything? Yes. Wow, that's, yes. that's really good. You look really good, like. Wow. <laughs> thank you. And you're not looking bad either. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What has been going on? 
Nothing much, just here. Madam, pushing it. It's not easy. And the studies? Well, I'm done with school, so just. There's no job, though. It's not been easy. You just. <laughs> it's not easy, I know. You did not bother to ask my brother, your boyfriend. Hmm. I'm sorry about that. So, how is he? Oh, it's okay. It's fine. I'm sure he'll be really glad to see you. He will be so happy. I guess. Well, I was on my way to the market. Okay. But I will definitely come to see you. I hope you brought me a lot of goodies because I don't want to hear story. You're welcome. Anytime. Any day. You are sure about that? I'm very sure. I'll come see you. So good to see you. Ah, good to see you. Alright. Take All right. care. See you. Hello, brother. Hello, Shoma. Shoma, how are you? Brother, good evening. Brother, guess who I saw today? No, talk to me. Munachi. Munachi? Munachi is in the village, brother. No, Shoma. Wait, 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 wait. Shoma, don't tell me you are joking. I am not joking. Munachi is in the village. She's back. You mean you saw Munachi? My Munachi? Ha. No, 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 no. I will come to the village. Maybe tomorrow. Okay. Yes. My my regards to mom, okay? Okay, brother. Bye. Monachi. Hey. That is okay. <laughs> Turn into something else. Yes, sir. There used to be a big tree here. I can remember. Okay. Yes, this Wow! Oh, yeah, wow, you wow, expecting wow, 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 wow. So much development. Cars. I remember we used to come around here to play and dance. It was all bushy. Let's make it small now. I learned that everyone um, trying to construct them in the shopping mall. Yeah, Tanya, Ike Market. You know, wow. Market. Yeah. Yeah. Do you even remember Ike Market? Uh, I can't go there on my own anyway. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Ah. This is really good. That's nice. <laughs> Just you, sir. <laughs> what are these girls doing? Hey! Are they not the children of Christy? How can they be jumping on a man like this? Just look at them, look at them. And I thought they were Ah ah! He is their brother! He is their brother! Which brother? From which mother? When did the principal have a male child? So you don't know? She had a child in Isiago, in her father's house. Uh -huh. Yes, before she was married into this village. Yes. How come I've not seen the guy anywhere around or heard anything about him? He grew up with his maternal parents and now lives overseas. Wait, you say he lives with? He lives overseas. Are you serious? Eh? Hey, how much she be so good at My dear, you can say that again. His husband people that we are oppre oppressing her in here, they now run to her for help. Hey. Yes. But wait, wait, wait. You see, man. I don't understand. Why are you asking that kind of question? Wait, 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 wait. wait, wait. See, you better stop the dreaming. Just stop it because it's not possible at all. Don't tell me you have eyes on I don't need to have eyes on him. I'm just telling you for you. It's not I possible. I beg, forget that thing. Please, my dear, I'm going to tell you this place. Are you going with me? Let's go. Hey! Good to see you. Good, how are you? 
fine. You look good. And you too. Oh. How is your journey? Very fine. Very perfect. Everything was good. Oh my God! Enough to me, but you. <laughs> you now would have been home earlier, but the vehicle I entered kept spoiling on the way. Oh, Sorry. Nigeria, Nigeria. <laughs> anyway, it's good to see you. Good to oh, see you. Stop! 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 Wow. <laughs> London did you good! You yeah. can say that again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so we have to go back, yeah. alright? That's it. Let's, let's go back. So, you're never happy to see me. <laughs> eh? So tell you're me. You're not happy to see me. We are, we are. <laughs> Please, let's go home. I am just coming up for you. I am When my sister told me that you have returned from London, I quickly ran to the village, delivering everything I was doing just to come and see you. Oh, that's nice. It's good to see you too. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Yeah, thank you. you see, to call the long story short, right from our secondary school days, you're somebody I love and cherish so much, even though you were my junior. While you were in London studying, I got a job in Enugu. And by the grace of God, I am comfortable. Mm -hmm. And I think it is good for me to settle down. Oh. Yeah, I think um, that's the right thing to do. Exactly. It would be a nice thing yeah. for us to mm -hmm. do. It would be a wonderful thing for us to do. For us? Yeah. How? Monashi, I am sure you don't need a soothsayer to tell you that I love you. Honestly, I, I love you and I, I want you to be my wife. <laughs> Why are you laughing? It sounds funny, right? No. <clears throat> Stan. You were very nice to me before I traveled out of the country. But talking about marriage, it is way beyond that. It takes a lot more than being kind or friendly. Stan, I'm sorry. I can't marry you. Please understand me. What name of this is so called Nancy? Her name is Genika. Where is she from? Umudike. Can I see her picture? Wow, she's pretty. <laughs> Yes, you're on the right track. You will see me standing in front of my house. Yes, 
keep coming. There you are. Nice to meet you. Thank you. My name is Genica. <laughs> oh, baby, let's go inside. Mom is waiting. Okay. Yeah. What is she? <laughs> you can say that again. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> so, 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 yes. Have you been away for so many years? How are you coping with life in this village compared to that of London? Mama, east, west, north and south, home is still home. There is nowhere that can be compared to Ebola. <laughs> that sounds so nice. <laughs> See, you gave us, it cannot be found anywhere else than Ebola. <laughs> Thank you, Ma. I still have more left in the bottle. No, ma'am, food. Thank you. Are you sure? The food is very delicious. <laughs> Pretty girl. I think I'll tell, tell my son about you. Eh? I would like him to marry somebody from a responsible home. Not all this, eh? Uh, let me know, good day. <laughs> hmm. Your son marry me. Don't even go there. Not while you are still alive. Unless after joining us together, you will die so that the marriage can take place. Don't you want me? No, thank you. She doesn't like it. <laughs> 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 Mama, I'm sorry. Where are you people coming from? I can end looking where you are. Good day. Good day, dear. What's, what's going on? Ah, oh, well, we just saw your fiance off. My fiance? How? Yes, Ginika. The one that says she'll only marry you if mom is dead. I. I don't get it. Yes, she just left here. What? <laughs> I mean, she's my fiance's sister. Hmm. It's a small world. Jesus, I'm willing to walk. Jesus, I'm willing to walk. He led me on a new. Jesus, I'm willing to walk. Jesus, I'm willing to walk. He led me on a new. I'm willing to walk. Jesus, I'm willing to walk. Mama. He led me on a new. Mama, this is why you're so happy today. My son, I'm just arranging this thing. Hey. Hey, hey, Mama, hmm? I would really like us to talk about uh, Sonia. That mommy water. Hi. Hey, Mama. Hey, I thought you came here to talk about uh, Ugoma. I didn't know that is that mommy water. Mama. Please, if you have anything, something reasonable to talk, we'll discuss about Mama. it. Not so Mama, I don't like the way things are going between you and I about the Sonia issue. Because let's try and resolve this thing. <laughs> Please. That mommy water. Hi. Uncle, I thought you wanted to tell me that you want to bring Ugoma back. Ugo who? Ugo. Mama, this Ugoma you're talking about, that you've been singing her name up and down. How many times did Ugoma visit you when you were ill in the hospital? How many times? She visited me in the hospital. She visited you in the hospital? Yes. Just once? Yes. Since then, since she got out of the hospital, how many times? Have you seen her in this compound? Have you seen her legs anywhere in this compound, Mama? Eh? Ugoma and her mother, they want you dead before I can marry her. How? You're asking me how? Yes. Ugoma and her mother said that the only way I can marry Ugoma is 
If you die, then they cannot have somebody who has a mother as an in-law. Mama, that is why I have carefully examined all the girls in the family. Mama, and I found out that Sonia fits in as a good wife. She will be a good wife to me. This girl is humble and respectful. Mama, see, you know that you cannot judge a book by its cover. I understand that this girl looks flashy and all that. You see all these how chores you complain about? She's ready to learn. If only we teach her. Eh? Mama, you know that this girl, she's not even going to be in this village with you. So I don't know why you're even killing yourself about it. Eh? Because you know, Mama. Oh, Mama. So for me, you can. Eh, Mama, because you know. Because you know, Mama. No, Mama. That was in there. That was in Mommy, yeah, that guy can't wait to. You need to see the way I will just lead up to the water when I'm just kind of uh, wearing my waist like this. Like, wearing your waist. <laughs> yeah, waist, that's what you're going to do. Because blue one on the line. Ugo Maso, you have said when you waist. Uh, ever since she met that boy, okay? She keeps whining her waist, left to right, right to left, forward, backward. Hi, Jim Biko. Nah, uh -huh. how did it go? Mama, I am so happy. I mean, the family is very nice. And her mother didn't sound like someone in the village. <laughs> <laughs> People from this village are exposed. Your mother is a good example. Yes, so. Yes, so. <laughs> Mommy, Mommy, if not for our mother in law policy, I would say that woman will make a wonderful mother in law to any girl that marries her son. Yeah. Is it okay? Well, just like Mona would enjoy having me as a brother in law. I do I don't know. Yes, so. Yes, so. Yes, so. <laughs> but Nana, come to think of it, when are you fixing the wine carrying date? Can we go on Mona? Eh, our king's friend, so they'll be getting ready. First things first. Which is? Um, Mama, I have to engage her. And that will be on your birthday. Hey! Yes, so Mama, that's the surprise I told you I have. <laughs> My son is going to make me proud. Yes, yeah, so. Mother, he treated me in a very special way. You wouldn't believe it. I stayed in a hotel for two whole days. He treated me like we were already married. And the most interesting part of this story is that his mom is in he has no sisters at all. He's okay. You have three males in your family, yeah? And that's it. I don't think we have any problems at all. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> so has he proposed to you? Um well uh, he hasn't. But I'm very sure he will, because he cherishes me a lot. <laughs> okay. My only advice is be very careful. I will. Yes, mommy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so how are you preparing for your friend's birthday party tomorrow? About tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Just wait. Okay. Wait. Uh -uh. wait. Oh. <laughs> okay. I'm waiting. Just check this out. Ah, check it out. How do you see this? Mommy, this is nice. You'll be looking very sharp at that party tomorrow. This is very beautiful. Trust your mother now. You know I don't carry last. Uh huh. Ma, tomorrow. Oh, don't go away. Oh, don't go away. Uh huh. You know me, la. Mommy, please allow me to finish this. <laughs> I will do the signature of our eyes tomorrow. Mommy, it's not your birthday. Someone else's birthday. Really? Uh huh. Organize one for me now. But of course you know what I mean. I'm your daughter. Then I have Stanley. I trust you. 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 Mama, you called me. 
That's my daughter. Sit down. Hmm? Sit down. Sit down and help me. Mm, my daughter. Help me. My daughter. Hmm? You think that I hate you? That is not true. But the problem is this. The way you look, the way you dress, people outside may look at you as you are not a responsible person. But my son has explained everything to me. Eh? Fifthly. Eh? Don't be annoyed the way I treated you. Hmm? I love you. Do you know this thing? Do you know what we call it? Yes, Mama. It's called Oka. Yeah. Do you eat it in your village? Yes, Mama. Hey, it's nice. No. Tell me about your family. Okay, Mama. I'm the second child out of six. Oh, oh, six. Mm. Oh, 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 oh. Six. Three boys and three girls. Oh, 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 that is three capital and three states. <laughs> My father is a businessman. My mother is a civil servant. Wow. Wow. That is my in-law. <laughs> That's fine, ma'am. So, this is my kid sister, Ugoma. Ugoma, this is my baby. <laughs> yeah, so what's good? What? Where are the chairs? You haven't set up? No, 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 no. where's mama? Oh my god, okay, just leave the set now, okay? Let me see mama. Let's go inside, let me see mama. Yeah, no. <laughs> I welcome you all to my mom's 50th birthday party. Without wasting much time, I would love to invite the celebrant for the cousin of the king. She is a role model, a motivator, a counselor, a teacher. The best mother in the whole world. So please, with a standing up later, let's welcome Mrs. Christy Ifedi. Hey, thank you. I feel honored to have you all here. I mean, we're family. It's my 50th birthday. Nothing so grand. But what makes it special is the fact that I'm spending it with family. God has blessed me so much. I am so grateful to God having come this path. All my kids are successful in what they do. My friend here and her daughter, they've been family friends for years. I thank you for being a good friend. God bless you. Well, she called me birthday girl. That means I'm looking young. <laughs> it's also the glory of God. And this cake, I meant to cut it, right? All right. F M I I F M T Y Y. Happy birthday to me! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Thank you! Thank you! My darling girl, thank you for coming home for the birthday. And you.
I am 50, but still 30. I am 50, but still 30. I am 50, but still 30. Happy birthday to me. Baby, the crash of the beat and it's killing them all, of course. It's killing them all, of course. Make we scatter this place tonight. Dance that sweat till I say that fight. He wants to settle this thing tonight. Come, let us catch the feelings tonight. And if you tell me, say, make a fellow, fellow, look for ways to do right. So, hello, hello, find it to go this way. This love, 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 we talk and go. Not because of you, eh, I get to go strong. This feeling got me falling. Yet, I do something they do me for what you know. I make you make me spend this money though Not because of you, eh, I get to grow strong This feeling got me falling Get out of something they do me for what you know I make you make me spend this money though This one right here, Lee and Romeo Original of Bongo Lopo Bo 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 Sing on me when the make comes to go Love me tender, love me tender Yeah If you tell me say me come there No, 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 no Look for ways to try for to do like so No, no, no If I did the joke, if I did the joke, it's so Yeah, it's love, 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 love not because of you, eh, I get to grow strong This feeling got me falling Get out of something they do me for what you know I make you make me spend this money, yo Not because of you, eh, I get to grow strong This feeling got me falling Get out of something they do me for what you know I make you make me spend this money on my baby for life. No, I actually don't want My brother here has something to say. Okay. Um, I want to thank you all for coming once again, and I want to say a big happy birthday to you, mommy. Thank you. Long life and prosperity. Um, I hope I now have your undivided attention. Um, I want to introduce a very special friend here, Monachi. I would have done this in London, but I decided to do it here in Nigeria on this very special occasion. And I'm going to ask you, Monachi. Please marry me. Say yes. Say yes. Yes, yes. I'm sorry. I can't marry you. I can't marry a man whose mom is still alive. And you told me that girl is a well brought up child. From a good home. Huh. That girl is not even from any home. Useless girl. Can you imagine coming here to utter nonsense? Like in me. Lanza. Eh? Ah, no, 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 I won't take that rubbish. You see, that is why I hate those girls that have been abroad for a long time. They don't have any inkling of what's going on around here. They don't know anything. 
They just come home and utter nonsense and have no no sense of what's going on in this country. Rubbish. Still don't get it, Mommy. No nonsense. Is she mad? Obviously, I'm not happy. But you know what? That girl will die before me. How can she say that you will die? Who for me? As young as she is, she will die before me. <laughs> that girl has caused my day. She has ruined my day. Imagine my 50th birthday. I'm off here. She will not even live to, fi- to, to, to see 50 years. Before she will get into fight that her mother has been taken to the mortuary. <laughs> Cheap much you know? The one where she will defrost. I'm telling you. Hey. 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 I'm mama. Hey, that's my daughter. That is good for them. My dear, see, I love what you did. So stop crying. That was a brilliant work. Okay? Why are you quiet? You did the right thing. Though we did not discuss it. Well, you should be happy you paid them in their own coin. No one came over me. I wasn't thinking straight. That was vengeful of me. I love Kozu. It's okay. You don't have to be hard on yourself, okay? It's okay. Mom, sweet for me. I am very happy, very, very happy. Now I feel avenged. Ah, I mean, I'm so happy about this. Listen, let me tell you. What you did, you did for the love of your family, okay? It's okay. That girl is very stupid. She is ill mannered. She lacks respect. Even if she must say that, must she have to say it in the presence of her would have been mother in law? That is the height of disrespect. No, mother. No. On the contrary, I think it's wrong for us to condemn her outrightly. I mean, what we and the Ifedis have had her own fair share of bad mother in laws. Uh, maybe she's also a victim of the same circumstance. Mm-hmm. You are right. That's. We must not allow emotions to be cloud our reasoning. You have a point here, though I didn't think of it that way. She's not worth it. She doesn't deserve it. You're too much for that girl. Eh? It's a good thing she said what she said now. That way, you know what's on the back of her mind. As for me, my God will always be there for me. He will always be there for me. But why, why would Muna lead me up to this point? Mama, just look at me. I'm an emotional wreck. I regret coming home. You did not come home because of her. You came home because of me. Your siblings, your only family. It's a good thing you came home. Now I can find you a good wife. A wife I will take care of you and honor you. Mama, Unachi is a nice girl. She, she, she speaks good of you. I just, I just wonder why she will wish my mother death. She's not good. If she was that nice, why would she wish me death? At least now we know what is on her mind. Forget her. No, man, it's not as easy as, as you say. It's not. Yeah, 
with our brother. Good memories. Someone we grew knowing little or nothing about. Yes. Just just look at what happened. Everywhere, everywhere is as quiet as a graveyard. Emma <laughs> Gwalia de Soku. Emma Gwali, Emma Gwali, Emma Gwali de Soku, Emma Gwali, Emma Gwali, Kiji Malum Madu, Kiji Mali. If you. Um, actually, I'll have to go in and pack my things. I, I won't be long, but I need to talk to Ginika for a while. I told you about her recent breakup, right? Yeah. Um, I, I just need to be with her to encourage her a little while before I come out. Is that okay? It's okay. It's a normal thing. She will get over it. Roland's picture. Goodness sake, I thought he is a forgotten issue. Well, I, I just came to let you know that I'm traveling with Stanley to Abuja. We'll be back in two days. Jinka, what is it? What? Ever since I came back from the village, I thought the villain was suddenly overtaking my whole being. I can't eat. I can't sleep. Why? Why? I mean, did he hug you? Was he here? Where is he? No, 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 no. So where is this coming from? I can't keep it out. My darling, you have to. You have to. You don't have a choice. 
You have to. Tried. I've tried. I, I keep forgetting that a part of him lives in me. Oh, well. There you go. There you go. That is because you have allowed his thoughts to have a foothold in your mind. And I think this is traceable to the incident that happened in your mother's birthday. I feel guilty. I feel like a thief. Huh? Yes. I feel like a thief. For not telling him that I'm carrying his child. <sighs> Seriously, you have to get off this mood. You have to. Try and do something different. Go somewhere. Go to the cinema. Maybe you could see a movie. Talk to people and feel better. If you don't have some money with you, I'll, I'll drop some before I leave. Take care of yourself. I'll call you when I get to Abuja. Please drop the spell.
to go back to the village. What? I'm tired. Take me to Gose's house. What? Please take me to Gose's house. I need to take this off my heart. I know that things are already in a bad shape. But I need to free my mind, please. Take me to Gose's house. I I don't understand you. I'm tired. I'm losing my mind. Take the last night. Take me to Brazil. Don't touch me. Just take me to Brazil. What do you want? What do you want? Eh? You've come to find out if I'm dead. Well, as you can see, I am not dead. So my son will not marry you. 
Go back to where you're coming from. I'm not here for that. I just want to talk to Gozil. Well, you will, my, my son will not say anything to you. Just get out of my compound, please. Just for the last time. For the last guinea. You're standing there staring at me. You want me to push you, right? You want me, you want me to push you? Mama, mama, stop, stop it. Please stop it. She's here to see me, at least. What, what is she here to see you for? She has nothing important to say. Let her go back to where, where she's coming from. Mommy. Please, can we talk? Yes. In private. You uh -huh. cannot talk to him in private. Because Mommy. you have nothing to say. All right? So, if you have nothing to say here, hold your peace. Mama. Ah, please. I'm sure she's here to tell you to kill your sisters before you can marry her. Mama, stop. At least, let's hear her out. I'm not here to reverse what has happened. Rather, I'm here to clear the air on why it happened. And clear my conscience. Because yeah, you and I have come a long way. You are everything any woman in her right senses will wish for. Dolia, no, Oma. I know you love me. But Sam cannot be said of me. You hear that? She doesn't love me. Well, that's what she said. My action and response to your marriage proposal is not because of what you did, but it's because of what your sister and your mother did. Which is, you know me too well. I can never wish anybody death, let alone my mother in law. Your sister refused marrying my brother simply because my mom is still alive. And your mother is screaming behind the rejection. Who is your brother? Roland is my brother. The one that engaged your daughter, Genika. Mama will be coming in two weeks' time with my kinsman for proper introduction. Genika, hey. yeah, That is good to hear. You thought I was not serious when I warned all of you not to marry a man whose mother is still alive. Each and every can know. Nem, I'm on work. Oh, you got Kabaru go and tell him that I said I cannot marry you. In a church, let me go. No, 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 no. Now, I'm a cock and see a cook. I'm wawara. You asked me to come over. Yes, I did. It is not in your place, nor that of mine, to undo what has already been done. I invited you here because I have a burden in my heart. I know we'll end up not getting married. There is something that has bound us together forever. Something that can never be broken. The ring? No. I'm carrying your child. And I think you should know. You know, I'm not a bad person. No, I'm not. 
I will never wish any man evil. But then, when I remember what my children and I went through in the hands of my mother-in-law, I can't help but weep. Her attitude towards me fashioned me into what I am today. And that's why we all decided and I advised my girls. Nobody should get married to a man whose mother is still alive. So they don't experience the same thing that I did. I would never ever wish anyone death. I'm not a bad person. I will never be able to kill anyone. I sympathize with you, Mama, and my sisters, for your ordeal in the hands of your late husband's mother. But I must say, you took it to the extreme. It is wrong for you to assume that every mother-in-law is evil. You were so consumed by your emotions and you forgot the fact that you were going to be somebody else's mother-in-law someday. Oh, didn't it occur to you that I was going to get married someday? It is so unbelievable that lots of girls in our society these days hold strongly to the fact that they will not marry a man whose mother is still alive. Forgetting that someday there will be somebody else's mother in law. The truth is that the wife of your male child should be treated as your own biological daughter. That same way, your own daughter will be treated as a biological daughter by her own mother in law. What goes around the sea comes around. I am truly sorry. Deeply sorry for the pain you must have caused your family. Please find it in your heart to forgive us. Please. I think you have to swallow your pride and protect your man back. You are in love. You can't be living in denial. Thank God the mother has changed her mind over this mother in law. I thank God that the matter has been settled. Hmm? Like I always ask of you to bring me the girl you want to marry. Mom, you already know her. No her. Did not bring any girl to me, or did he introduce any girl that he wants to marry to you? Me, in your absence of the will. Can you say what? I did not go to his house. Uh -huh. Mom, Dad, she's not only going to be your daughter-in-law, mm. but she's carrying your grandchild. <laughs> hey! Already? Uh, uh, uh. Ah? Oh, hey! 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 Oh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>
since yesterday and she has refused to pick up my calls. I have a feeling something is wrong with that girl. All is not right. No, 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 Mama. Don't say that. Don't say that, Mama. I think we should call Gina or Roland. Call Roland, please. Okay. Hey. She probably might be busy or something. His number is not in shape, just keep trying. So make it. You're too impatient. Down now, and down and wait. Just give me this one. I'm here with your mother. Gineka, is your mother now? Open up, please. Are you even sure she's there? Um, what? Eh? Break, break down the door. Nah, break it, break it. In case there's something wrong with that. <laughs> Gineka, what? How? Oh, Gineka. Gineka, what is it? You got me worried. What is the matter? Eh? Gineka, you chiku me Thank <laughs> you. 
Snatcher. Oh, you think you can take him away from me, right? Hmm? Huh? Es excuse me. Stanley, who is she? What is she talking about? Honey. Hold it there! Don't honey me. I have been monitoring you. Oh, is this the funeral rite you told me you're going to the village to do? Instead of going to the village, you took your mistress to Abuja, right? Oh, are you surprised? I follow every move you make. And as for you, I left you all this while because I was trying to gather more information about you. Now I have gotten all I wanted down to your village. Leave my husband alone. Leave him alone, okay? okay. Take care of my husband. Hold it. Now, Stanley, I need to understand what is happening here. I mean, why would you stand here and allow this thing talk to me? Who is she? It's fine. She's my wife. See, Gina, we're actually planning our white wedding before my mother died, so we postponed it. You know, you never gave me the opportunity to come close to you when I was single. All of a sudden, you came offering me yourself on a platter of gold when it's, it's already too late. You know, a man gotta do what a man gotta do. I have to have my own piece of the cake. Sorry. Honey. Please, 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 just, just leave me alone. Take me out of here. Rubbish, this less woman. He has left you. Why did you say that? Wait, Mama. <laughs> Mama, this is Val. This is Val. Val is married. Val is married. Val is married, Mama. Val is married, Mama. <laughs> Together. Grandmother wanted to take everything away from her son. And that is why the only man qualified to marry any of you. Must be a man 
whose mother is dead. When I say dead, I mean dead and buried. Do we all agree to that? Yes, Mama. Yes, Mommy. Wait, did you go to my house? Or did you by any chance meet my mom? Yes, I did. Oh! Felix, you have, you have finished me. me. Why now? Why? God, hey God, why now? Why? I went to school, you should have come to my school. How am I supposed to know you're not around? Moreover, I was trying your number and your number was not going through. Well, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to put you into any form of trouble. That's why I still stayed out here waiting for you. I've heard you. But, what does your mom mean by she, she won't have me as an obstacle to more qualified men? What does she mean by that? Why, why would she say that? Qualified to do what? To marry you, of course! Felix, are we talking about marriage here or are you indirectly proposing to me? Wait, how can we be talking about marriage when your mom has already rejected me? Felix, until we start talking about marriage, for now, I don't have an answer to this question. So, how is your mother? Is she getting better? Well, she's fine. I came here so that you were accompanied to the hospital to go and see her. Please, I'm not going. I'm going home. See you later. Bye. Ugum. Ugum. End that relationship. Look at them at the If it's him, pick the call. Okay, now. Hello, Felix. Please, I'm sorry, I can't continue with this relationship. That's it. It's over between us. Please. Ugoma. But why? What is happening? What's really happening? Hello, Felix. This is Ugoma's mother. How many times have I told you that you're not qualified to have anything to do with my daughter? No, 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 no. If you think that you love her so much, that you would really want to settle down with her. You know what? After this telephone conversation, kill your mother. But I know you can't do it because you don't have the liver. So, stay away from my daughter. Quit calling her. And you know what else? After this conversation, delete her number from your phone. Goodbye and have a good day. Cause you know, I'm not a bad person. No, I'm not. I would never wish any man evil. But then, when I remember what my children and I went through in the hands of my mother-in-law, I can't help but weep. Her attitude towards me fashioned me into what I am today. You took it to the extreme. It is wrong for you to assume that every mother-in-law is evil. You were so consumed by your emotions and you forgot the fact that you were going to be somebody else's mother-in-law someday. Oh, didn't it occur to you that I was going to get married someday? I am truly sorry. Deeply sorry for the pain we must have cost your family. Please find it in your heart to forgive us. Please.
Don't look okay. What's the problem? I would love to go to Felix's house, but I don't have to call. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. What if I don't have the courage? I don't understand. Are you laughing at me? Not at all. Um so what do you want me to do now? I would like you to go with me to Felix's house. Of course I will, but like right now. Yes. Mama, what's what happened? What you wish me did not happen? I'm still alive. You can't say I'm still alive. Mama, I cannot wish you dead. I will never wish you dead. I thought you are a responsible girl. I didn't know that you are wicked. You are a very, you are very, very wicked. You are a wicked girl. Mama, what's going on? What have I done? Hey! Stop asking me stupid questions. Tell me what you want. I've come to say Felix. Which Felix? My own son. Felix will never marry you. Oh yeah! Get out of my compound! I said get out of my house! Where can I get out? It's you. Mama, my daughter. What's going on here? Why are you shouting? My daughter in law. You can see this is not this one. That is my daughter in law. Oh, yeah. Get out of my house. I never you said you are letting my company again. It's nice here. Yeah. It's yours. You thought that here yeah, would die. I'm still alive. I will not die. Mothers, mother-in-law, your daughter-in-law is even more your child than your biological daughter because she has come to stay with you forever. All you owe her is love. Take care of her, pamper her and guide her through and she will learn from you and love you in return. Makeup. Oh, it's been tough. I nearly gave up. But I give God all the glory that today I made it. You know, patience is a virtue. Just be strong and believe in yourself. You get what you want. It's my day. Yeah, it's my day, finally. I'm, I'm so happy. <laughs> So what's your advice to young ladies out there? Oh, 
So a friend of mine once said that if her phone is falling down and her mother-in-law is falling down at the same time, she would rather save her phone and allow her mother-in-law fall and possibly die. Oh, girlfriend, no. You have everything. Someday you're going to be a mother-in-law. Yes, you're going to get married and you become someone's mom. And you become a mother-in-law. So please, I advise you young ladies, please cherish your mother-in-law. As you can see, I'm getting married. And I promise, I'm going to cherish my mother-in-law. Yes, I'm going to love her. And again, this goes to my mom. Oh, mommy, I love you so much. I know you're watching this, yes. My daughter loves you. What are you, mommy? Love you. And my new mother, my mother-in-law. I love you. The lesson here cannot be overemphasized. It's all over. I'm glad. I'm happy. Love prevailed. <laughs> I'm getting married. Starts by nine o'clock and it's already past eight. Remember, it's your best friend's wedding and that of her brother. Please hurry up and go and take your baths. Wait, don't tell me you are taking about her. Hmm? I've told you to forget everything about him. He is not your husband. Your true husband will come at the right time. Okay? Time. Time, you see, mother. Time does not wait for anybody. I am a lady. And I am not getting any younger. I lost the man I love because we refused to forgive our past. <laughs> now I have lost it all, Mother. I am the loser. Mother, I am the fool here. Kinika was lucky to have hers restored. But mine is gone. Good forever, mother. Mine is gone. Please cry, okay? Mother. My heart is too heavy. <sighs> Words have failed me. I realize my mistakes and foolishness. It is almost too. It. It's entirely my mistake. Please forgive me. Hmm? Forgive me, Nem. <laughs> Let's forgive our past and hope for a better future. You are still beautiful and young. Your own husband will come. Okay? Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying.